Welcome, my friends. We have today the very first Queen Walk Valkyrie Minor hit. It's never been seen before, never been done before, and yes, look at this beautiful action. Wizard there for funnel, and then I'm going to queen in, queen walk in. Now, this is a queen charge, queen walk, what have you. Couple minute plan. I hit this live on stream, so be sure to watch it on stream. Anyways, couple minute plan we've got here. We're just going to let the queen go in. I'm going to wall break in at the archer tower at 9 o'clock, and then another double wall break in into the inner core. Valkyries are for the middle. So now this has been a strategy that would have been a little bit tougher without the post, uh, well, since post update. The reason I say that is one, you're going to find out. All I'm going to need from the core for the Valkyries is one heal spell. Typically, what you would need is a rage and a heal, probably, definitely, for, for those Valkyries to survive. Because in this sort of ring-tight four-corner base, it's very common uh, that you see a lot. I know it's it's an old, very old meta, but extremely still common. And this is why, um, yes. Um, anyways, there goes the wall breakers on the first opening. Gonna have to pop one more rage because, uh, look guys, the queen is taking a couple more damage than I hoped. Here comes the other wall breakers. They're gonna come in hot, break in the queen, and I'm gonna face the enemy queen under rage. What that guarantees is don't need a poison for the enemy queen, just need a rage. Again, if you didn't know that, you can rage up over enemy queen. Your queen survives. Even with two expos on her, she survived. I decided to put the rage. So here is the, I could have popped the ability, um, but I put a rage on the queen to keep her alive. King goes down for some funneling. Here comes the rest of the Valkyries into the core. Now, all I ha all I brought was six Valkyries plus the CC Valkyries. And look what I did in the core. One heal spell because of the post-update. Inferno Rays don't do any damage. Domination. They survived that whole core section without a rage, anything like that. Previous, you're gonna, you would need a rage and a heal. So that means your queen either pops ability or, um, yeah, so it, it just makes a huge difference. Anyways, miners are there. I, I did the queen walk miner. You don't have to bring miners. You can bring hogs or anything. I did miners because someone on stream said, hey, Halo, use miners. Do. Do it. Use it. And so I did. King. I think my king would... Look at my king. He, he pretty much was useless this whole raid. He got down one structure. He beat down two walls, got one archer tower. So luckily I didn't have a time fail. Make sure you bring some cleanup guys. You see that wizard at 3 o'clock? Definitely need him, and I have another wizard up at a uh, 10 o'clock area. He's going to hop down soon, and uh, the miners, of course, are doing some work. It came down to the wire. I had about eight seconds left, I bet, uh, something like that. But anyways, if you're looking to take down this base, you could do it this way. You can take down this base many different ways, but give this a go. First ever, I think, Queen Walk Miner hit, Valkyrie hit, 10v10 three-star that I have seen on post update, of course. Was this viable before? Yeah, you could have done it. It's just easier now. Guys, thanks again for watching. Truly appreciate all the help, all the love, and be sure to subscribe. Make sure you click on, um, uh, again, the other YouTubers I've mentioned in my uh, cards. Make sure you click on their names. Psycho, Maxwell, Clashing, FFS, Forge From Steel. See you next time. Halo out.